Rachel, fancy that. Yeah, Bruce, fancy that. Yeah. Rachel, Natasha, Natasha, Rachel. Natasha, are you the prima, prima ballerina for the Moscow Ballet? Hmm. Wow, Harvey's taking me next week. Really? So you're into ballet? Bruce, this is Harvey Dent. The famous Bruce Wayne. Rachel's told me everything about you. I certainly hope not. So let's put a couple tables together. I'm not sure that they'll let us. Oh, they should. I own the place. How could you want to raise children in a city like this? Well, I, I was raised here. I turned out okay. Is Wayne uh, Manor in the city limits? Is, <laughs> the Palisades? Sure. You know, as our new DA, you might want to figure out uh, where your jurisdiction ends. I'm talking about the kind of city that idolizes a masked vigilante. Gotham City is proud of an ordinary citizen standing up for what's right. Gotham needs heroes like you, elected officials, not a man who thinks he is above exactly. the law. Exactly. Who appointed the Batman? We did. All of us who stood by and let scum take control of our city. But this is a democracy, Harvey. When their enemies were at the gates, the Romans would suspend democracy and appoint one man to protect the city. And it wasn't considered an honor. It was considered a public service. Harvey, the last man that they appointed to protect the Republic was named Caesar, and he never gave up his power. Okay, fine. You either die a hero, or you live long enough to see yourself become the villain. Look, whoever the Batman is, he doesn't want to do this for the rest of his life. How could he? Batman is looking for someone to take up his mantle. Someone like you, Mr. Dent? Maybe. If I'm up to it. What if Harvey Dent is the Caped Crusader? <laughs> if I were sneaking out every night, someone would have noticed by now. Well, I'm sold, Dent, and I'm going to throw you a fundraiser. That's nice of you, Bruce, but I'm not up for re-election for three years. No, you don't understand. One fundraiser with my pals, you'll never need another cent. <laughs>